market controller kit with stepper motor card. Now we are going to de demonstrate how to interface a micro controller kit with a stepper motor card. First of all, I will disconnect the card and the supply. I would like to show you this is the supply for our stepper motor card. We are giving a separate supply so that it does not load our kit. First of all, I am going to plug in the supply. Now, before making the connections on the kit, make sure you are doing it with the right polarity. You have to make sure on this angle, you have to make sure that the taper part goes into the angle slot and it does not go the other way around. Never make connection like this. After making this connection, the second part is connecting the card to the kit. Before connecting, make sure that the kit is turned off. This program is written for CN13 that is 82551. So make sure that you are connecting it the right way. Before connecting, make sure that the pin number on the card and the kit are synchronized. Which means that as you can see here in the card, it is written 1, 2, 25 and 26. These are actually indication of pin numbers. And same way it is written on the kit. Right here it is written 1 which means the first number pin. On the cable we have an indication of this pink dotted line which can be used as a reference for connecting. After making the connections we will turn on the kit and we will uh, go to our manual for stepper motor card. In the page number 5, you can see clearly that the program is starting from 2000 at its value and it goes till 202A and then the delay routine starts from 202D to 2036. Now, to enter the program on the kit, we will first uh, press examine memory, EXMEM, this one. Then we will start go to our starting address that is 2000. Now this is our address and this is our data. In order to move to the data, we will press next. As you can see, here the number is display. In a normal kit, the uh, data on the kit will be random. But right now I have downloaded the program from the PC to the kit. I will first tell you for the few lines so for the program in the kit. Like here you can see it is written 90. FF0374800F0 As I press next FF037480F0 Likewise the program has been inserted till 202A It is written 022006 022066 And then our delay routine is 7F 327EF9 but right now it is then changed for reverse motion now after inserting the program and the delay routine you can in order to execute the program you have to press go and then the starting address at 2000 and then press fill. Right now here you can see that the motor is moving. Make sure the supply has been turned on. There is an indicator for indicating the power supply on and off. Now in order to reverse this, now right now the configured delay routine was for reverse. Now to make the rotation in forward direction I would have to change the data at these addresses 2008, 2013, 2013 and 2025. In order to do that I will first press reset I will go examine memory 200A then press next. Right now you can see here it is F9 for reverse for forward I will have to change this to FA. FA then I will press fill. 
एग्जाम इन मेमोरी टू जीरो वन थ्री नेक्स्ट हे इट इज राइट नाउ इट इज एफ फाइव दैट इज फॉर रिवर्स फॉर फॉरवर्ड इट इज एफ सिक्स फिल एग्जाम इन मेमोरी टू जीरो वन सी नेक्स्ट एफ फाइव फिल एग्जाम इन मेमोरी टू जीरो टू फाइव Then I press next. As you can see, also it is F A right now. That is for reverse. I will change it to F nine for forward. Then press fill. And then I'll press again go two thousand and fill. Now you can notice that the motor is moving in the forward direction. That is in clockwise direction. Earlier it was in anti-clockwise direction.